Korea recorded another trade surplus for the month of November. That's the 34th a straight month in the black. But analysts say the outlook for next year's numbers isn't looking too great because of the falling Japanese yen. Our Kim ji has more. Despite concerns stemming from the weakening Japanese yen, Korea's annual exports are expected to reach $1.1 trillion by the end of this year, with new record highs for trade volume, export volume and the trade surplus. The trade ministry says annual exports grew by 2.4 percent during the January to November period from the same period last year. This comes amid concerns raised by Korean exporters of unfavorable currency conditions, mainly due to the strengthening of the Korean won against the weakening Japanese yen. But it may be too soon to celebrate as local experts say this year may be the period of calm before the storm. Up until now, Japanese exporters were passive in cutting their unit prices, but that may change next year as their profitability is improving due to the weak Japanese yen. More aggressive reductions by the Japanese are expected to take a toll on Korean exporters next year. The current exchange rate hovers at around 951 to 100 yen, the lowest it's been since 2008. The expert also attributed to Korea's declining exports to China and a U.S. interest rate hike as some of the main concerns that could affect Korean exports next year. Kim Jeon, Arirang News.